all around us. Even in places you might not think to look, <laughs> like electrical boxes at intersections. Digital anchor Brady Smith shows us these mini murals. On a brutally hot August morning, artist Santiago Perez found shade where he could as he mixed paint to put the finishing touches on his latest work. It's about the colors of the black community, the, the success of the black community, the vibrancy of the black community. His canvas isn't a traditional one. It's a traffic signal control cabinet, the kind you see at intersections all over town. This one's at Fifth Ward, right at I-10 in Waco. It's fun. It's great. I love it. I mean, I cannot. This is this is the reason why I came to United States, though. To share your heart. To do, to become an artist. This is what your average traffic signal control cabinet looks like. Kind of dull, gray. You don't really notice them. But with the help of the city of Houston and local artists, Up Art Studios is turning these things into works of art. Within the city of Houston metropolitan area, we're, we're almost at 400. And how many artists are you working with? Um, over time, it's probably been close to 100 artists. Elia Aquiles and her husband co-founded Up Art Studios. Originally, our mission was to help graffiti artists make that transition from the street to the gallery. A few years ago, they figured out smaller projects might just have a bigger impact. We'd seen this idea being done like all over the world, and we just thought, why aren't we doing it here in Houston? Up Art pitched a partnership to the city of Houston, and the program's been wildly successful. That's what I love about this project, is, is being able to um, put art in communities that are often lacking it. Reporting in Houston, Brandy Smith, KHOU 11 News.